So you do your tray from the thing, like a little tray counter. Then you grab your main course, and you got your sides and the veggies and stuff. And then you go check out, and you go to your lunch table. We interviewed three students on the cafeteria workers and how they show their appreciation. Why do you appreciate the cafeteria workers? Because they give me food and not, I mean, everybody needs food and I love, I love food. Because they prepare food for people that don't bring their own lunch. Because they make food for me. Uh, I say thank you. I say thank you after I get my food. I'm always say thank you whenever I'm in line and stuff and yeah. And they make food for us. <laughs> I don't have one. Um, I like them they make the food for me and they make always make good food and stuff. Pizza. My favorite food is Big Daddy Pizza. Spicy chicken patty. For Bison Plus, this is Ryan Lyle. Quentin Yearwood. Kellen Atherton. And Asher Rogers. I like to sing and do theater. It's just my most enjoyable extracurricular activity. Well, I always wanted to be um, Cinderella in a musical, and I did the musical last year, so. I just joined Fall Musical because mostly I needed a way to spend some time with other people, and also it helps my skills with choir, so it's a win-win scenario. Uh, because I joined last year, and I had a lot of fun making the costumes, and helping all of the people with their makeup and it was just one to do it again. Uh, I guess started back in high school. I got involved on the technical side of theater. Uh, I started out helping with building and painting sets uh, and then from there also got involved in lighting and then eventually got into sound and did just about everything on the technical side. Uh, and then later in college um, started to get involved on stage. The Prince um, the Prince is the lead male role. Um, I am a spotlight operator, so I will be uh, the head person for one of the spotlights. I love like getting to design the costumes. Like, what is this person going to wear? How are we going to make it look unique? Stuff like that. Well, I like being able to see what happens behind the scenes. I just like um, being able. Also, I get to man the spotlight, so that's a lot of fun. Um, well, she a lot of my favorite parts of the school I'm not in, so I like the king and queen part and the part where the sisters are mad at me. For Bison Plus, this is Tristan Hayes, Kaylin Westacott, and Marshall Turner. We asked members of the herd what it means to be a bison. Well, I feel like it means to be a bison to be a part of the school and get engaged and stuff. It means that you're courageous, nice, and that you have good grades. To be a leader? I don't know. But it means to be a bison. It means to be kind and respectful, to take your education seriously, um, work hard at school, show team spirit, um, help others out, be involved in the community, be involved in our school community. To be respectful, kind, and courageous. It means to be a bison. It means to be a strong community that takes care of everyone in the herd. Um, it means to be kind, caring, nice, helpful. I think that here our bisons, especially my goal for bisons is for you guys to be kind while you're learning so that you can take all that greatness on to high school. Being a bison, the cool thing about being a bison is we're a brand new school. We get to set all the new traditions. Everything is almost like brand new all the time. What is your favorite part about being an eighth grade teacher? I love that I teach science because I get to do fun labs outside with my students on occasion. Eighth grade teachers, I've been doing this for 20 years. So I have, old, I have been teaching longer than all the eighth graders have been alive. So it's fun to see that eighth graders are still the same after two decades of me doing this job. Just go Bison. Go Bison! Signing off, this is... Aubrey Johnson. Aubrey Asbury. And Elle Cobbler. How are you feeling about the upcoming Pep Assembly? Um, I'm a little scared, but like, I'm also excited at the same time. Because like, we get to do it in front of like, the whole school and stuff. So. 
excited, but we're doing like a lot of things, so it's gonna be a lot. Very excited. We've been working on it very, like, we work very hard. Um, I feel like we're ready, and we're doing pretty good at practicing. What is your favorite chant that you guys do? Um, it's definitely the beat of the beat. Beat of the beat. <laughs> well, Bison Plus, this is Avery Goodwillow, Layla Leonardi, and Holly Dunn. Um, because it's a different style of music and you don't normally get to play piano at school, and I wanted to play piano. Um, I joined jazz band last year because it just felt like something cool, better to do because normal, I do love normal band and the jazz band music is actually really cool so I wanted to join that and saxophone has melody so we're not playing harmony for once. Um, yes, hopefully, as long as I make <laughs> a tryouts. Yeah, I'll be returning to jazz band this year, hopefully I'll be able to make first chair this time um, because Jasmine was just so much fun last year that I'm going to do it again this year. Well, we did get donuts, so that was, that was pretty fun. Um, but that's not a reason to join. There's many more reasons, like to discover a new genre of music and to play fun concerts. Um, yeah, if you want to have some fun and play some different music, uh, come join Jasmine. For Bison Plus, this is Harlow Wagner. Kate Floyd, Abigail Bobby. What are you grateful for? I'm grateful for my friends and the absolutely unhinged things that we say. This is band one. Um, we, it was in the middle of band and uh, I just had this random thought. The saxophones are all united as a cult. Tenors are top, alto saxophones are equals to tenors, and then there's baritone uh, saxophone that's just their own kind of different. <laughs> Um, I'm grateful for my friends and family because without them, I guess my life would be boring. I'm grateful for the football team, uh, the games, and just hanging out with friends. So, so I'm thankful for a lot of things, um, but in this particular time of year, I'm thankful that the school year has been a good smooth start, and I'm extra grateful for some good weather because I'm tired of the 100 degree weather. So that's what I'm thankful for today. Uh, I'm grateful for my mom because she gives me everything and I'm grateful for my dad because he makes me like happy when I'm sad or feeling down. Uh, I'm grateful for my brother and my entire family and my dog because uh, they all make me laugh and they make me smile and they give me a good time when I'm feeling down. Having a roof over my head and having family and animals. I am grateful for my family and friends and what they do for me. Signing off for Bison Plus, this is Caleb Thornton, Deanna O'Malley, Wesley Hoover, and Camilla on a queen. Um, I've been playing volleyball since I was little, and I think the sport's really positive, so every time your team does something good, they hype you up. Um, because it's like fun and like, it's a fun sport to do with like all my friends. Oh, because it's fun and I want to make new friends. Um, well, we won by a lot, so it was an interesting game. <laughs> it was fun though, it was fun. Uh, I'm a middle hitter. Uh, we like block all the balls that like when people like try to hit, and then we also like hit. I'm a middle and you block people and you hit. You also cover your other hitters. I'm an outside hitter and I hit the ball over the net after the setter sets it to me. Signing off for Bison Plus is Lincoln Bixler, Miles Benica, Lawson St. John, and Weston Reed.